become a spiritual baddie. What I mean by that is that just embody the goddess, the baddest of the baddest like spiritual bitches or spiritual baddies in this world, you know, start that manifestation, go after your rituals, do magic. Why the fuck not become the spiritual, like the ultimate spiritual baddie and, you know, create the life of your dreams, you know? Use those techniques. Those there's so many def different techniques, like on the internet, out there, everywhere. You know, embody the energy of it. Like you know, meditate on it, script on it, make that vision board, and motherfucking manifest it. You know, manifest it. You know, um. Just get in tune with the universe and work hand in hand with the universe. And like I said, just make things happen because you can and you should. You should become the spiritual baddie and just, you know, live the best life that you can and just do everything that you want to do in life. You know, because life is so freaking short not to be a spiritual baddie. A hundred freaking percent. Like, is it not true? Like, why be miserable and why be in this negative energy? And why ignore the signs of the universe when you can be the motherfucking spiritual baddie of all the baddies? You know, why not motherfucking manifest your dream life? You know, why not embody that, that witch energy? Why not become that witch that you want to be? Why not do that magic? Why not do that meditation? Whatever it is, why not collect those crystals? Whatever, you know, that spirituality means to you and whatever, you know, a spiritual baddie means to you, why not become it? Why not become that spiritual baddie you have, like, always wanted to be? Like, forever. Why the fuck not? What is holding you back? What is truly holding you back to be a motherfucking spiritual baddie? Is it, like, that boyfriend that doesn't support you? Is that family that thinks that you're just fucking weird? Is it, like, whatever. The looks that you get for wanting to be a spiritual betty or doing like spiritual practices because who freaking cares you know it's your life and if this makes you happy that's all that matters sweetheart it's all that freaking matters you know why not embody the energy of having it all why not embody the en the energy of being like you know, I don't know, the sorceress of your motherfucking life. You know, you can even be a spiritual sorceress if you want to be. You can even be a spiritual king, okay? You can be all the bad, <laughs> the bad, <laughs> like the biggest baddie of all the biggest baddies in this spiritual realm. Why the fuck not? Embody it and just bring it to fruition. You know, and become who you are really truly meant to be. And create the life that you truly deserve and you truly want. You know, why the fuck not? Why not be a spiritual buddy and like, you know, create that magic in your life that you need and crave? Why not, you know, collect those crystals that you want? Why not fucking script all they want? long why not do all those fucking vision boards why not do every possible manifestation technique and manifest all that you want why not what is holding you back like what is truly holding you back is it yourself you know because like i said it's your life in the end who fucking cares what anybody else thinks
If you want to be a spiritual baddie, that's all on you. If you want to become a motherfucking spiritual baddie, it's all on you. You can become a fucking spiritual baddie. Because you already are a spiritual baddie. It's nothing special that you have to do to become that or find that or change or nothing. No, no. You already are that. Just open yourself up to it. Open yourself up to that idea and embrace it. And motherfucking make things happen. Because you deserve it. I hope this helps anybody and I will see you in another one. Bye.